Hey guys, so we have our next Cat Lady box for August. And it wasn't that long ago that I was actually doing the July box. They kind of, um, in terms of filming, came back to back just because I'm a little bit backed up in terms of the boxes. So I'm excited to get into the Cat Lady box because so far I've been really happy with this subscription. I am at the point where I'm thinking I'm going to need to cancel it or at least put it on high hiatus for a little while because I need to kind of trim a little um, bit on the expenses side as far as subscription boxes are concerned. And I'm in the process right now of kind of weeding out what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to um, let go once the subscription actually runs out. So I might put this one on hold for a little bit as I'm waiting for some of the other subscriptions to kind of wean themselves off and because I've really enjoyed this box I wouldn't be surprised if I end up revisiting this one later so I haven't made any definitive decisions on it yet but just be forewarned that this one may go on temporary hiatus if you're interested in the cat lady box definitely check out the link down below and let's get into it because I've always enjoyed this box and what it has to offer and I'm excited to see. So the sep oh, September, oof, oof, August theme. <laughs> August theme is From the Desk of the Cat Lady. And here is our art card for this month. I'm not looking at the spoilers that are on the back. We'll look at that in a minute. So the, my particular box, in case you didn't know and you haven't watched the other ones, particular box that I get is usually two to three items. There are other variations including ones that will include an item or two for your cats if you're interested in that. Uh, but this is the two to three item box and usually the items in there are super cute. So let's take a look and see what is from the desk of the cat lady. And this might be perfect for me because my office is actually my entire company is changing buildings and so my cube space is going to change within the next three to four weeks and so new desk things for the new space might be might be nice so the first thing that we have is literally a cat lady box <laughs> how funny so it looks like it's a, um, a some assembly required but it looks like it's kind of an inbox so to speak that could sit on the top of your desk and it is in the shape of a cat so it looks like it's made out of kind of a hard foam maybe uh, it's hard to tell I think it's kind of made out of a hard foam and there are all the pieces in there so it's something that I would need to put together but this is really really cute I could see putting this on my desk with some like small desk accessories. Um, maybe put like my hand lotion and hand sanitizer in there and have it kind of tucked away to the side so that it's accessible but not in the way. This could be happening. That might be happening. All right, next up we have a shirt which could be worn in the office I suppose. We'll have to see what it says. <laughs> this is so true. I work hard so my cat can have a better life. <laughs> so I do work in a uh, corporate environment so this might only be appropriate on a casual Friday or maybe a work outing or something like that but I think it's really funny and it's definitely true so that'll get worn. All right and then the last item that we got this time around are oh they're magnets. Oh how cute. So there's the magnet and they are little cats on here. I think these will end up staying here at home on our fridge. Uh, partly because I'm not sure if the new bins that we're getting will really work well with magnets. The bins that we have at work currently are kind of hit or miss. It depends on the magnets. So these might not work too well at my new space, but that's okay because I got a fridge and we love magnets here. So. Anyway, <laughs> so those are the items in the Cat Lady box for this month from the desk of. And as usual, I think they are delightful. And I enjoy this box so very much. So 
I will be probably putting this on hold. I don't know. Um, the one thing that is a little bit of a miss on here, I'm just a little bit of a mistake. Um, the spoiler card kind of cut off on one of the descriptions and it says retail value and there's no retail value listed. So one of the items, the t-shirt, I don't know what the retail value is, but that's okay because I like it anyway. Um, anyway, that's the Cat Lady box. I got nothing more to say about it other than, other than that I love it. If you like cats, if you like stuff uh, with cats on it, then definitely check out their link and you'll probably be seeing at least a couple more boxes here coming up and maybe in the future. I don't know. I don't know if I can let it go. We'll see. You'll have to come back and see whether or not this box stays or goes. We'll see you next time. Maybe. Bye.